All right, first video on the new tripod. Gonna try filming fans from this angle from now on to uh, kind of stabilize everything. But before you today is a 44 inch Coca-Cola ceiling fan from 1998, I believe. Um, yeah, it's pretty cool. We'll uh, get you up close real quick here so we can show it off. does need to be cleaned up. It was definitely mounted in a kitchen before. So if anything, I prefer fans that were mounted in kitchens because the grease from the kitchen does kind of preserve the finish on the fan. So I think that's okay with me. So go ahead and demonstrate it here. As you can see, it has a later added on forearm light kit with the center globe. The center globe was definitely original, but uh, I can imagine that the previous owner of this fan wanted a little more light. So they opted to add this uh, forearm light kit and put the center globe in the middle. Uh, that forearm light kit was painted red and they did a pretty good job. It matches quite well. Low speed's kind of fast, but it's also a 44-inch uh, fan, so I didn't expect it to be that fast. Just wanted to make sure the globe's tight there. Here's medium. Naturally, the blades do kind of droop. Um, I think that's just because of the awkward shape they are. They're heavier on the end. And as you can see, we do have a little bit of a wobble. That third pull chain is for the forearm light kit. It, they just didn't delete it. I would have done that, but they probably just left it there for aesthetic purposes. All it is is a second switch for the light. And here's high. The fan actually performs quite well. Um, it is a lower quality fan. I bet it's got a little 153 motor in it, but you know, it holds its own. It does okay. Good air movement, just needs to be balanced and cleaned up. Not a bad little fan at all. Pretty excited to clean it up. And uh, I have thought about putting it in my kitchen. I just don't know how well it'll look or blend in with everything else. That's the thing with it, it's kind of hard to uh, put this fan in the room. You gotta have a very specific decor. But you know, I do like it. It's got the cool rings on the side band, which is really a nice touch. And I usually find these fans and they're really expensive and I was happy to find this one for a mere $20. And the, uh, the light kit really adds to it, it makes it unique. So, so yeah, as you can see, spend time's pretty good on it too. So. Uh, we might as well watch it stop. We, we've come this far. I usually don't like filming fans all the way to stop, but some people enjoy watching that. So if you're one of those people, enjoy. No bearing noise either. I mean, the bearings are clearly in good shape if it's taken this long to slow down. The blades are not that heavy either. I thought they were going to be heavier, but picking them up, they're really not all that heavy. And if you're curious as well, the uh, the other side is just plain white. I don't know why anyone would want to put that side down. There's no fun in that. The fan was probably made in 1997. That's what the sticker on top of the motor says the uh, the other information has faded off unfortunately i can't really read that but such is life
Hey, that thing's still going. That's a good thing, though. We like to see that. All right, well, there you have it, folks. 44-inch Coca-Cola ceiling fan. Hope you enjoyed, and thank you for watching.